wanted to do a quick video just to show you how easy it is to make the green drinks that I drink. They're really smoothies. I don't juice, um, so I get the fiber. Uh, the greens that I'm using now are, um, you can find them at Costco in huge bags, so they're organic. And then I also added some uh, curly kale in with that. Uh, a lot of times I'll use dandelion greens or Swiss chard for extra greens. So um, besides the greens, I put start out with about this much water in here and then I add the greens and as you can see it's pretty packed in here. Um, I have um, some beets, lots of nutrition in beets. So I took a half a large beet and cut it up. I have a green apple. I have uh, ginger root. A lot of times I keep this in the freezer and just pull it out when I need it. But I have, as you can see, a few chunks and this is will give my drink a pretty good kick. And uh, usually I have turmeric root, but I didn't have any, so I'm actually going to use some powder. So I'm going to put that in there. Okay, so now all I'm going to add is um, the pineapple, and the pineapple helps with digestion. It has a lot of enzymes in it. It is a little high in sugar, so I don't put a ton in here, so that's maybe about a half a cup. And after that, I just fill the whole thing up with water. I'm using reverse osmosis water, so use make sure you're using good water in your good drink. Stay healthy all the way around. This is the best drink ever. Easy, you can mix it up by putting other fruits in it. Um, you can put other vegetables in it. Sometimes I put celery in it or cucumber. I really like cucumber in it. So then I'm just going to turn it on. So when it's done blending, I use mason jars and this is, this is what saves me. It's, I don't have to do this very often. I do it like once a week, sometimes twice a week. So I have this big container of yummy, it's really not green juice anymore because I have a beet in here, but it's delicious. So what I do is I put it in mason jars. I don't fill them all the way up because I put them in the freezer. So about three quarters away full. I've learned that the hard way. I used to fill them up and um, if you fill them all the way to the top, when they freeze, it expands and your glass will break in the freezer. So don't do that. But anyway, it's taken me maybe 10 minutes and that was with getting all the stuff out and ready. Um, and then I usually put one that I'm going to drink right away. This is a great lunch. So what I do is add water to this. I like mine thin. I don't like a real gritty um, juice. So um, now what I do with these is I take and put the lid on them and put them in the freezer. Three quarters away full when they come out of the freezer. Um, I let them thaw out and then I fill all the way to the top with water and shake it. So, um, so it's a little bit more runny than it is now. But they're delicious, easy to make, no excuses. I'd love to hear your recipes. So.